The atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone, and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. And the match day noise at this place is truly special. The pride, the passion, it adds to a massive sense of occasion. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? There's no shortage of great fullbacks in the game today, but Robertson really is among the very best. Some true legends of the game have sung his praises, and I can't disagree. Pace, directness, distribution are all his outstanding qualities, and he does it time and time again. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. Joao Palinha. Played out to the right. For João Cancelo. João Cancelo. Now it's Bruno Fernandes. Oh, what a... Oh, shooting chance! Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. And now they can spring out of defence. Bruno Fernandes. Nice interception, his positioning was spot on. And back to the goalkeeper. McGinn. A real chance to break. Bruno Fernandes. Well played, that has snuffed out the danger. Scotland playing high up the pitch here, very much taking a front foot approach. Done delicately. This is promising. Looking for a corner. He's there to clear it. Portugal can counter promptly here. Vitinha. Antonio Silva. Bruno Fernandes. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Now it's Rafael Leal. McTominay defending his corner stubbornly stood up very well to his man. McGinn, and that has left him in a heap. Bruno Fernandes concedes a free kick for that. Bruno Fernandes is being told in no uncertain terms that this will be his final warning. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. That's good play. Christie. Christie! And he's done very well to get to that. Christie sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Rafael Leal. Very nicely done. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Now it's Rafael Leal. That is good strength. Bruno Fernandes has a shot! Oh, what a wonderful...
Look at the full stop. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Bruno Fernandes with the short one. Bettinia. McTominay gets a foot in here. And now a sudden chance to counter. Now it's McTominay. Hit into the middle. He's felt that, hasn't he? McTominay. Christie. To McGinn. Excellent challenge there, uncompromising. And he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Well, you might think he got off lightly, it is just a verbal warning. Now it's Adams. There's the hit! And that was very necessary. And they can counter here. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. João Cancelo. And it's Cancelo. And if anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. Score first. Oh, a goal of real quality. He made it look ridiculously easy. Well, most of those go high and wide because of their difficulty. He made it look like he does it every day. Portugal take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Again. Portugal leading then, courtesy of the goal scored late in the first half here. 1-0 the score. Ruben Diaz cuts it out. That's nice. And that's a surreal chance! Rafael Leal. And there is the half-time whistle. Steady, solid, and for now, where they want to be. Just one goal, and they have it. Good effort from both sides, but at half-time, it is 1-0. Tirelessly for me. Portugal leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. And the action has already resumed here. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Oh, it's played into the area. Bruno Fernandes. Here's Rafael Leal. And it's played forward. Bruno Fernandes. Nuno Mendes. That's a good run down the left. Nice control. 
Oh, that's a key interception. Christie, forwards and with intent. The pressing's intense, and it's paid off. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Jao Cancelo gets it clear. Over to the other side. Oh, he's... And the finish! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. And that has been clear. Portugal can start a counter here. It's an inviting looking ball back. Rafael Leal. The ball is loose and the chase is on. And nicely intercepted. Bernardo Silva. João Palinha. Towering header! He hits the net! And there's the goal they've been looking for. A lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Portugal grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. No attempt, just the wrong outcome. Well, that's confidence for you. Distance doesn't even bother him. Bruno Fernandes... Bernardo Silva. Great ball, and he's in. Rafael Leal! They are rampant! And they are pulling clear here. The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Three nil, and things are starting to look awfully cosy. Well, that's really winded the opposition. You can see their manager screaming on the touchline, telling his team to calm down. But they'll need to do that pretty quickly. It's composure from here. Vitinha. Portugal have scored two quick goals here. And it's Bernardo Silva. It's a good run down the right. Tierney clears. Antonio Silva. Bernardo Silva. And João Palinha. 
He's had a fair tumble under that challenge. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. in possession and ready to go again well it just petered out no penetration at all having had a great deal of the ball Christian he's got the shot away he scored comfort yet more comfort easing away His movement is all based on fine margins, and the timing of his run then was ideal. Portugal tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Gets his pass away. That's very neat. Now here's the delivery. Ping towards the front line. Oh, easy pickings there. McGinn. Christie. Oh, good ball. Moved on forwards. Yeah, I think the word from the touchline, Peter, is that defence needs to focus on runners and, and balls over the top. Yeah, it's a, a clear change in approach, isn't it? Yeah, and if they drop off, there has to be a strong level of... And that's clear-cut, it's a free kick. McTominay. Now it's Adams. Christie. McTominay. Out to the right. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Scotland have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. It's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty late. Antonio Silva. Portugal clearly now in lead preservation mode. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Rafael Leal. Bruno Fernandes. Added time going up here, it's three minutes. Begin. Christie. 